I don't see how it can be enforced without the use of racial profiling. And, and, and as a result, I think there's a better way to do it. The better way to do it is to check the immigration status of everyone you arrest. I've worked on this in Florida. We have a policy that we do check everyone, adults and juveniles, but we didn't have the money to check juveniles. So I passed an appropriation that would allow us to check the immigration status of juveniles who have been arrested for a crime. Well, we did that for a year. We sent the information to the federal government, and the federal government did nothing with it. So I do understand why states are trying to get involved, because the federal government has been sitting on its hands. I hope that the federal government will act and pass comprehensive immigration reform so we don't have to have every state pass its own laws. So the answer is I think there's a better way than the way Arizona is doing it, uh, but I do understand that the federal government needs to act and stop. Uh, in, in fact, if we can spend as much time acting and passing comprehensive immigration reform than suing, I think we'll be doing uh, a lot uh, a lot more good.